Dude, recently at the gens, I've been getting a piece of, or I'd get sandwich bread, like the standard white sandwich bread, ham, salami, pepperoni, provolone cheese with mayonnaise and lettuce, not toasted, not pressed, just cold. Dude, Ooh, like that's people, that's kind of dangerous. I don't know. <laughs> people like underestimate a good just cold sandwich. Yeah, like with that type oh, of yeah. Bread. Killer. I like a cold sandwich, there, but a press sandwich. Like, yeah. But the thing about There's that some, is, like, the outside's warm, but the inside's still cold. Yeah, that's what I like about it. Meat. You don't like that? No, I'd rather no. It all be hot or all be cold. Wait, like, how do you, why do you like that? Well, I just, like, I don't know. It's kind of, like, crunchy on the outside, yeah. and you, like, kind of bite in, and you get, like, at least the cheese gets melted, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And yeah. then, like, the cold cuts are still cold, and I don't know. I think it's, like, the best of both worlds. I could be crazy, though. I'd rather have melted cheese on my sandwich though melted I'll cheese is huge yeah game changer yeah dude one time i went to subway and i was in line behind this person and it was a subway i used to go to a lot uh-huh. and when i was younger i got a meatball sub and i put like honey mustard or something on it because i was a weird little kid <laughs> and i was in line behind this person and they ordered a meatball sub and the guy <laughs> making the sandwich was like well as long as you don't put honey mustard on it because some weird kid comes in here and gets that and i felt so bad <laughs> i went up there and just changed my order completely <laughs> that's so bad I, I would just probably walk out i, I don't <laughs> that's <laughs> wild man. honey mustard i don't know why serious? i switched to ranch ranch on a meatball sub is pretty fire i that makes more sense than honey mustard yeah i don't know that's, why that's I, I went through a phase where i really liked honey mustard and now I, it's gross. I don't I like it I think it's anymore. pretty mid. I, it's I all right. Know. Like, just the mustard part in it. I was okay. Like, nah, like, I don't want to try How it. do you feel about Dijon mustard? I like it. I like a little, I like the, the stone ground spicy mustard. I get some of that. Dude, you're hitting me with these, like, names. Like, I don't. Stone, yeah, I mean. I'm, but I, I've never heard of it. I'm not knocking you for it. I think it's, it's pretty on a, on a brat. Oh, yeah. Bratwurst so good oh yeah they're so good what's your go-to cookout like what are you getting uh, dude i just had sausage for the first time and what? i i swear to you <laughs> nice like oh. two weeks ago and uh at rights and that was your first that was time your ever. first time yeah dude i just talking about my weird eating habits well i'm picky Do they just not have sausage in vegas no they had sausage but i was just like i don't know i was just grossed out by it and then I had rights, and it kind of changed my life. Dude, right. Kind of changed my have life. Have you ever had, real question, have you ever had a hot, like a hot dog? Oh, I've had a okay. hot dog, right. Sure. I always just thought, like, sausage was, like, the grown-ups. You know what I'm saying? Like, hot dogs were for kids. Yeah. I just. Mm. Like, sausage and brats were a different. Yeah, they're yeah. just a different tier. And yeah. I, mean, I think the first sausage I had was at Costco or something. Back when they did the Polish sausage, mm-hmm. like, the foot long. They did really that? Good. Yeah. Costco's wild, man. Dude, Costco. Costco and Sam's, man. They're on to something. I started, like, because uh, I'd be so, I don't know what to do for dinner now that, like, mm-hmm. usually after practice, we'll get the dinner. Now that we don't. So it's like, I don't want to go make food. Or yeah, like, you're in weird limbo. So Once the to, red card runs out, you're like, and I just don't I need to eat. the red card. <laughs> right. So I'll just go to Sam's. Dude, I'll be getting, like, a rotisserie chicken. They have, like, pre-made meals. Like street oh, yeah. tacos, chicken alfredo, mac and cheese, everything. So I'll just go get a couple of those, stock up for the week. Yeah, that's a smart move, dude. I've never really thought about that, but I need to check out Sam's. I haven't been yet. Mm-hmm. I need to go. It's solid. Sam's is good. I'm a Costco guy, but I've only had they Costco. I know they don't have Costco here. Costco's nice. I do like Costco. They don't have Costco here? No, it's Sam's it's, Club. It's all Walmart. Sam. Everything's Walmart. Oh. I wish they had a Kroger, though. I love Kroger. I wish that if I'd rather have a Publix than a Kroger. Yeah, but I guess Publix is your Kroger and Kroger's my Publix. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. I don't know. You guys are Talk speaking in like sub. a different language right what now. What was your like <laughs> go- what was your grocery, grocery store? store Probably like, went to Trader Joe's or something. No, no, no come on, like, dude. Stop on the West Coast. Yeah. <laughs> dude, no. I went to Whole Foods. That place is wild. Dude, it's so expensive though. Oh yeah, it's no, we it was like disgusting. We got like five things and it was seventy dollars. My that's wife said we're never going here again. Like it's cool for like a like if you want to get it's like, like nice the experience, yeah, special occasion. Yeah, but they got a lot of cheese. People that like shop there, really? like weekly, <laughs> they got like two hundred different types of cheese. But that's just like unnecessary. Like I don't yeah. know. Where was your? Yeah, what's your what's store? your grocery store in Vegas? Albertsons. <sighs> I, I think I've heard of it. 
Yeah, no, see, man. like, that's crazy. Uh, I'm trying to think of something else. Have you ever been to Publix? Oh, Safeway? I've heard of Safeway, yeah. Okay. Never been. Yeah, that's They have all a Safeway in Memphis. Okay. Oh, really? Yeah. What's it? Is it just it's standard just a, grocery store? Yeah, just a grocery store. I want a Bucky's, though. Have you ever been to Bucky's? No, dude. I, we, I need to go. That place is ridiculous. Wawa is better. Isn't that Wawa? Only, like, whenever Wawa. I think of Wawa, I think of, like, Philadelphia. Yeah, no, it's... It's um, uh, a New England area. Like northeast. Yeah, northeast. That's the yeah. that's the term, but it's trickled its way down the East Coast. We got a couple. We had one, we had two in Gainesville. Really. And it was really nice. I always hear people raving about that place. They have good. Uh, they call them hoagies. They don't call yeah. them subs. Is it a gas vegan. station too, or is it? Just yeah. Convenient? That's nice. Dude, their breakfast, fantastic. Mm. They got like pastries and they have little sandwiches. Mm -hmm. On the way to church, I'd get a coffee and a sandwich that's every clutch. Sunday. It was good. That's cool. Dude, that sounds so sick. They're uh, they're I, building the Roadrunner right by my house. So I'm kind of hyped for that. What's the Roadrunner? It's just like a gas station convenience store. They have good they stuff. Have pretty good food. So. Oh, do you, uh, did you ever go to a racetrack? They have racetracks in Vegas. The gas station racetrack. No, I don't think so. <laughs> did they open one up when I was living in Orlando? And they had frozen yogurt, like. A frozen yogurt section where you could go and fill it and then put the <laughs> oh. toppings on. It's wild. I loved it. No, I, I had that one of those too. Yeah, no, it's no, it's crazy. Like it's it's, slurp, it's elite. Fro -yo. It literally. That's crazy. It's pretty dang good. I love frozen yogurt. I'll take frozen yogurt over ice cream. Mm. It's more. It's more of like an experience to go do frozen yogurt, but ice cream's way better. Yeah, I think I get well, more. I just like the texture. Like I like that like mm. soft serve. Yeah. yeah, I hear I what like you're custard. saying. Like I'm Freddy's, not, yeah, Andy's. I'm not a big fan. Nah. Have you been to Andy's yet? Andy's, dude. No, I heard That's about Andy's. You need to go to Andy's. Andy's is. We crazy. need to go to Andy's. After dude, get it. Do you like root beer floats? <laughs> <laughs> root beer floats. I don't Everybody mind a good. Root beer. Yeah. Dude, you gotta <laughs> gotta go ask for a, what is it a root beer freeze? They like they make a root beer float and then they blend it. No. Yeah. It's just like root beer soft serve. Yeah. Nice. It's really good. That's and you can get any soda they have. One time I had a Sprite one. Uh, it was interesting. I don't think I'd like that. I don't know if eh, I can do that. I feel like ice cream, though. I feel like the syrup in the soda makes the, mm. you know. Yeah. Sprite but they have, a, I think they have like an orange soda. It's like I'm a dream soda. Yeah. I'm weird about that stuff. Like, if I'm going to go, like, sweet, I want it to be good. I don't want to test something new. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like, yeah. if I'm going to put on this weight... Like, I want it to be worth yeah. something. You know what I'm saying? Andy's is worth Dude, you can get everything there. I usually get the, uh, what's it? It's like the jackhammer or something. Mm -hmm. It's like the multiple layer one. Yeah. Dude. So good. So good. Nothing, though, beats, like, McDonald's hot for <sighs> Sunday. Oh, my God. No, Wendy's Frosty beats. Ooh, Wendy's, Fro yeah, Wendy's Frosty is good. Dude, I'm, those I'm two are those, elite. I'm putting those, those back in there. Yeah. like... Uh, we we went to when we, you went. Did you go with us to Wendy's even, that one day? I don't think so. That would have been. <laughs> yeah, it was a tight squeeze. We took Addison's. <laughs> oh my uh, god! Jeep. It oh, was me, Jeep. you, Brooks, Brock, and Addie. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I got the uh, the Dreamsicle Frosty, right. the new one. I seen that. Not as good as the vanilla, but decent. Bro, do y'all remember the um, the Rollo McFlurries? Yes, dude. Those were game changer. Wait, why am I blanking right now? No, I don't think I've ever had that. Dude. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. sounds actually really good. Yeah. That's when like Rolos like popped on the scene. There was like, oh, what is this? It's so good. <laughs> the McDonald's. See, I feel like we only think things popped on the scene because we were so young and weren't like fully conscious. Because <laughs> one time I was like, I was thinking of some product and I was like, okay, it was new when I was like eight. And I looked it up and it started in like the 60s. Yeah. I was like, okay. Well, <laughs> not Rolo's over pretty far. Man. Well, welcome to another episode of the Boss Hog Podcast. Uh, today I'm joined by Patrick Kudis and Fernando Carmona Jr. And we'll be talking about the upcoming spring game this Saturday. Uh, we got one more spring practice and a walkthrough, and then hopefully we'll see you there. It's Saturday at noon, I believe. Yep, at noon. noon. At noon. see everyone there. See, people are like, well, how do you not know when it starts? And I'm like, well, we got to be there at like 9. So, so yeah, we're there at 9. It starts at noon. Yeah, yeah. but that's kind of nice. We kind of get to sleep in a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Breakfast at 9. 
Oh yeah, they're having breakfast. Yeah. yeah. Oh, like upstairs. Yeah. Yep. So. Dude, they during camp last year we had. So you know how we have just breakfast sandwiches because we have yeah. practice. They gave us like a full spread. Oh. And no, it was. Like, it was really good, but it was just too tempting right before practice. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I feel like I'd gain a lot. I mean, I'd gain a lot of weight. Yeah. I know I would. But it's like, it, yeah, like you, I at least like pancakes, me, eggs, bacon type thing. Like or I need, like, yeah, dude, ooh. the full like muffins, cereal. Ooh, yeah, I think they had biscuits and gravy a couple times. Yeah. But like for me, at least, like I need all that because like, there's some days where I just go in with like one breakfast sandwich, maybe like an applesauce, and I feel mm. terrible for the breakfast. <laughs> really, mm. it's hard. It's hard to eat before practice. It's hard to eat when you wake up. That's the worst. Yeah. Because, you know, like, those next two hours from waking up to, like, getting to practice is, like, it's hectic. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's hectic. It's You're running around. Like, Especially you to, if you yeah. oversleep, like, even a little bit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's the worst. If you ever sleep, like, 15 minutes, it throws you just everything feel like off. everything is off. Yeah. And you're just like, oh, my God, I'm behind. It's crazy, man. Like no tree. It's like I, I, I can't get in the hot tub that day. I can't get ready for breakfast. <laughs> Dude, that happened to me this morning. I set my alarm for 5.30, and usually I go like 5.30, 5.35, 40, 45, 50. Oh, you go by fives? Yeah. I go by tens, but. Uh, I just, I, if you look I, at my phone, <laughs> I have an alarm every five minutes from like 4 a.m. to midnight. That's crazy. I have like 200 alarms on my I, phone. Yeah, that's. I literally, I only set one alarm. I was waking up to it. That doesn't scare you. This guy's a maniac. No, like I, I are you, yeah, it doesn't you're not terrified when you go to bed that you're not gonna no, hear because it. The well he second, has roommates too. Oh, that's true. Not even like the second that the alarm goes off, I'm like I'm awake. <laughs> it's so weird. That's how you're supposed to do it. That's if you train your body to get up to one alarm, you'll do it. But I've just nah. it freaks me out. Like I don't understand how people like have multiple alarms. Well, I just I overslept once my freshman year and once my sophomore year. And so now I'm just terrified that my alarm's not going to wake me up. Like Apple does that like auto, like every eight minutes or something. It'll re yeah. It, so. Yeah, I'm not really. But like, do you ever like not like roll over on it and like it's just under your body and you can't I'm hear not, anything? I'm not, do you sleep with your phone in your bed? Yeah. That, do you? It's next to my bed on a yeah, nightstand. Like my, I got my bed frame. It's like a, a shelf above, so I just put it above. Do you not have like a little... Table I next to your I bed? do, but like I like to watch YouTube before I go to sleep. Dude, that's uh, what bro, Brooks will fall asleep. It's like YouTube full blast. Oh yeah, same. Like I have to walk in there I'm like, dude, you gotta <laughs> Between that and like the snoring man, I'm like, come on. Did you ever watch uh, Bob Ross to fall asleep? No. Dude, I went through like a two month phase where to go to bed I would just turn on a Bob Ross episode on uh, I think it was either it was when it was on Netflix or it may mm -hmm. have gotten on YouTube. And I would just watch it till I fall asleep, and I'd wake up like two hours later, and he'd still be painting away, and I'd turn it <laughs> off. It's kind of peaceful, though. Yeah. I just fall nice. asleep to like uh, gaming videos, like GTA gaming. <laughs> right. Like Van Something you know hectic. Oh, of course, dude. dude come I on. I used to fall asleep <laughs> to that all the time. He was great. I, I love that guy. Do you know about Van Oss? <laughs> no, I don't watch ah. streams. It, it wouldn't even, no, like he'd upload like a YouTube video like every week. I'd always wait for that GTA oh, yeah. to come out. GTA I was great. I love that. I'll go back and watch him sometimes still. Yeah, no, he had great videos, dude. I missed, like, yeah, that was, like, that the, era. Yeah, and, like, right. You never saw their faces, so you're always, like, Who are look they? up Van Oss Gaming <laughs> face reveal. H2O like, right. Delirious face reveal. <laughs> All right, we're geeking out right now. We need to chill. <laughs> dude, I just I don't understand, like, watching people play video games. I don't know, yeah. dude. I think, I guess because, like, I was a little brother, so I always watched my brother play. Mm -hmm. And, like, mm. I don't know. I felt like that always was, like, fun. You know, I, I don't even care, like, yeah. to play. It was like, oh, my God, what is he doing? Like, so I'd always, I don't know why. I just never, like, got, like, I was into <laughs> video games. But, like, if my friends were playing, I'd much rather just, like, watch them play. You know? I don't know. Yeah. Okay. My, see, my older brother, he liked watching me play. Mm. And so he'd rather me play. So I always just played. Yeah. Like that whole whatever this thing is. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it was cool for like a couple weeks. Now it's just kind of starting. To be it's like, but but the, what's the streamer's name? Sketch. So people would say, oh, that's Sketch or whatever. And I thought they meant it was from a, like a skit. 
like a comedy <laughs> thing. So I was really confused. Like, which one is it? Bro? Yeah, because my <laughs> wife sketch. is like, oh, it's sketch. I'm like, no, it's. <laughs> she knew what it was. Well, because she saw it on TikTok, and it was yeah. like, uh, go up to your husband and, and just put a finger up and say, uh, what is it? What's up, brother? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And so she did that to me, and I was like, I know what that is. I don't know what I'm supposed to do in response. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but she's like, it's sketch. And I was like, no, it's a streamer. She's like, yeah. no, it's the streamer sketch. That's I was like, funny. Oh. That dude is hilarious. No, I'm like, like good for him. No, literally. Like, it's gotten overboard a little bit. Yeah. Everybody says <laughs> you know that. Who loves that? Tommy loves that. Tommy V. Yeah, yeah. Tommy V loves so that. So Street. Street's a big not E. E Harris. He is too. Yeah. yeah. He can catch E throwing I, it in up. The meeting room, I'll catch him. He'll just like <laughs> sneak with him. What's up, brother? And I'm like, all right. Yeah. Meetings be fun, dude. Yeah. Well, that's a good segue into spring ball. Fernando, how are you liking your first spring at Arkansas? Dude, I'm I'm having a blast. Like every day is a challenge, but like it's fun going into work with like guys like you, mm-hmm. Coach Mateos, and Pittman, and then even Petrino. Like having him, like all those guys in like one building, is just feels I don't know, refreshing and just like it makes you kind of wake up and be like, all right, this is this yeah. is real. And uh, no, it's been a lot of fun and. I don't know. I can't really complain too much. What would you say the biggest difference is here at Arkansas compared to San Jose State's spring practice schedule? Just every play you have to bring it. Like, mm-hmm. there's no one play where you could kind of take off. Like, if you take it off, like, you're losing that rep and you're looking yeah. bad on film. You know what I'm saying? So I think just kind of being mentally locked in every rep, every period, every snap is, like, it's huge. And it's, it's good to train my brain that way if I want to go play at the next level. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now this is, is this your second? Yeah. Okay. I didn't come in early. You didn't come early? No. Oh man. Did you go, did you graduate early? Uh, what do you mean graduate? Did you get to college in January? Oh no, no, no. I no. came like when everybody right. else. Oh, yeah. Okay. I like it that way. Yeah. I, I feel wouldn't, like I wouldn't early enroll, honestly. I could You're wrong, but it's okay. Did you early yeah. enroll? Did I like super early enrolled? I went to bowl practices. That's just crazy to me. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I don't, what's the point? Uh, another free semester of college. Because I graduated early, I'm going to finish my master's program by the time I'm done. That's fair. Where if I didn't graduate early, I'd have another semester. Yeah. Good for you, man. Jesus. That's pretty hype. That is. But I mean, it, to each their own. Yeah. Anyway, what? <laughs> what's the biggest difference this year compared to last year for you? Probably the energy. Like every day, like he was saying, it's there's always energy around. Like last year, there was energy too, but this is a whole new level, you know. And like mm-hmm. getting to like see the progress we're making every single day, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I like that. We definitely have a better grasp of the offense. Just yeah. oh yeah, I mean, just compared to two or three practices ago. Yeah, hundred percent. Even today, like every, every <laughs> I mean, yeah. Like really. That one play we went over today, it finally clicked for us. Yeah. Um, Which one? The, uh, the uh, um, can we uh, say it on mic? Uh, like roll. Yeah. Okay. Yeah yeah. 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 No, I'm still. Yeah. Well, we'll, t- we'll tell them after. Because what you said to me from what it was last year, were like the backside and the front side. Yeah. Okay. That was, dude. That clicked for you. So you're going you're gonna to be like, dude, what? <laughs> why don't we just say that the first time? Right. It's almost like you just need to hear it twice. Yeah. Because sometimes in like those morning meetings, like yeah. you're just trying to stuff your brain with so much stuff that like so much. Correction. Especially when it's like presented at the same time as something else right. that you definitely need to focus on. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's good, yeah. though. It's good. I so, think just the way that we're communicating is like mm-hmm. insane because we just have to. There's well, just so much mm-hmm, so many yeah. pieces going on and like parts that mm-hmm. if you don't communicate. You're just screwing each other over. Yeah. Yeah. And then the more we communicate, the better picture we have of the whole defense. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Because, yeah. I mean, tackles, tackles can see their half. Guards can only see, like, that. just like right in front of them. Yeah. yeah. And the center can see everything, like, in the backfield and both mm-hmm. sides. But it helps yeah. me so much to know what y'all have. Because, like, if Fernand, like, if I say, I know Fernand, like, if you say something to me, like, what you're doing, I'm like, oh, 
he's doing that, going there. Right. So I'm not worried about that. Like me and Addison of this, and then that means Braun and Key. Well, yeah. Boom. Yeah. It's like okay, I see what we're doing. Now. It's hitting the brain. Like yeah. what? Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. It's fun, dude. It's fun. fun. Yeah, we're definitely having more fun, especially when we have those big plays, dude. Oh yeah, there's nothing better than that. We Jeez, have to pull Y'all are hating clip. on my uh, airplane celebration. <laughs> if you're gonna throw up the Ooh, airplane, no, I had. I, so I played with a center. <laughs> I just pulled that out. Of I one. played with a center who would do that all the time. Like that was his celebration for any big play. Yeah, yeah but I think if you're gonna sell, like, you had to sell out. You had to go like you arms just, wide. Like, you went. <laughs> you went like seventy five percent. My shoulder was kind of hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to get it up there. That's fair. Uh, but then someone hit it with the. <laughs> yeah. The top hit. yeah. <laughs> Addie told me that I was like, dude, you need to text that. That's like crazy. that is hilarious. That that looks exactly like it. Yeah. Yeah. it it's is. almost like the waddle. Yeah. It's fun to see like the younger guys progress during spring. Yeah. Like Kobe. Kobe. Yeah. yeah. Man, that guy's yeah. a dog. He's so young. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. I need to have him on here. Yeah. <laughs> That's That'd just be funny. Yeah, like his mind is just. I wish like he, he, fresh. he just hasn't seen college football yet. And he's no, just like he's having no idea. He has no idea. He has, he has like, no idea. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> he's got like, I can I can remember <laughs> Come my in. first practice, they threw me out at tackle. This was during like bowl practices. Oh no. <laughs> and the defense messed up their twist game. So instead of the DN and the outside linebacker, instead of the DN going B gap and the outside linebacker hitting the outside, they both went outside and they just grabbed me and like threw me. <laughs> and I tripped backwards and then fell into the other tackle. So I went like fell this way, hit the other tackle, and then face planted. Oh, no. <laughs> so oh, oh no. Gosh. That's Dude, the so I just, college football. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Gosh. Everybody has those moments. Yeah. I had mine like like day one it was yeah just i first of all i put on my ankle braces the wrong way so <laughs> we like get out of meeting they're like all right you got 10 minutes now like the older guys are like yeah bro like get taped up and get braced up before like the meetings because like you're only gonna have 10 minutes yeah so they're like 10 minutes i'm like oh shoot i run down never put on these things i don't know how they got on my feet they were like crooked it was bad <laughs> Not even the point. <laughs> so I go out there. I'm like, dude, I just feel stiff. My knee braces are falling down. I didn't know how to put those on. And then like the second play, I'm like setting. Senior comes, boom, right to my chest. And it was like, it was only spiders. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> and I was just like, wow, all right. This is yeah. going to be a long year. And now we're here. <laughs> dude, it's funny how your body adapts like the older you get. Mm -hmm. right. my my first fall camp was during covid so we basically had 20 spiders practices and we had spiders since like week mm -hmm. one have we no mm -hmm. i kind of like that though yeah i don't like i don't like going in spiders yeah but it so like from from here to here was just one big bruise <laughs> <laughs> and now my body's just used to it so i don't yeah. like it yeah. at least the bruises don't show very yeah. much Aaron has a lot of bruises Dude, on his chest. Aaron's so torn up right here. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh. Aaron, man. What a freshman. Yeah. freshman I think mine was, was like pods against Stu or something. <laughs> and I just got put on my back mm. bad. Because I was like, In all right. pods? Yeah. Oh, that's a tough way like to start the day. The day. Oh. Man. I was oh, like, all right, no. here we go. <laughs> cool. Fall who's, camp. That's who's Stu? He, uh, he was a DN. He played the year last year. Mm -hmm. Deshaun Stewart. What number? 58. He's yeah. not with us anymore oh. on the team. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I sound like a I'm sorry. Um, but the thing about Kobe, man, he has so many years left. Dude, he has five years. Yeah. That's a lot. That's a lot of years. And college football is different than the F and the NFL. Like they they'll take care of you in the league. Yeah, but he's just got five. He's just five. Just oh, going at it, man. Good for him, man. He got <laughs> this. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great. It's a great experience. It, it is. is it is. It really is. It, it is. builds character. I would say that it definitely oh, builds yeah. character. Like it makes you into a man. It does. And my dad said, because uh, my dad he played at West Point. And oh, then he went Jesus. to the army after, and uh, he said he knew he could do 
any of the army stuff. Like anything that he had to do, he knew he could do because he did college football. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And that was back in the day when they were doing three a days. <laughs> Dude, he told me they would have breakfast, then practice, then like two hours off, then meetings and practice again after lunch. And then they would have dinner and practice after dinner. <laughs> See, ah, dude, I hear those stories and I'm just like, your body has to be like, at that third practice, like, you're not moving. I mean, you're moving, but. <laughs> what were they getting out of it? That's you're the thing. Like, that's, that was the normal to them. Like that. Yeah. But they were that was just, just like what we're out. doing, like our normals now. Our, our whole week, one week in our spring ball is one day for them. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's wild. That's wild. West Point too. I got a buddy that plays up there. I think he plays corner, but he don't. He runs track and plays football, so it's kind of cool. Mm. Fast kid, real fast. Kid. Man, that's a lot, especially at West Point. I know. Wow, like, how do you balance that? Yeah, I don't know. He, they were telling me they had like twenty-four credit hour semesters, and I was having like twelve and still struggling. Twenty-four. Yeah. Do they, they had Saturday like, class. Oh my god. <laughs> They were like, so you know, no in high school, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no way, no, no online at all. <laughs> oh yeah, exactly. Oh, you know how <laughs> books, <laughs> going dude. to the library, yeah, you, wow. having to cite things by hand, dude, man, no easy bib, citation cool. generator, no, no chat GPT, no chat GPT. Oh. Respect to them, man. Respect to them. So you know, in high school, you'd go to classroom, however, uh, seven to three, and uh, then you'd have practice, yeah, every day. He was like, that's just what you did. And then Saturdays, they had Saturday class. <sighs> that's just wild. Dude. It's I, could, I like, couldn't do it. I, I, no, I'd no, like to say I could, but like. Right I, now? You throw me in there? We could do it. We don't want to, but we could. We could do it. Yeah. And we would do it if we had to. Yeah. Because, yeah. You know, we always say like, oh, man, I wouldn't do that. That sucks. But like. We would knock it out. Mm. Yeah. yeah but they do a good job of taking care of us here. They do. So they I really do. It's nice. They they these this coach and staff cares about their players. Oh yeah. And it shows and it makes us want to play hard for them because oh, yeah. we know they have our backs. Mm -hmm. Especially it's a Taylor special Taylor. feeling. It's a special mm -hmm. feeling. Yeah. Taylor's, I, like we know he's got our back. Yeah. That's what I like. And what he said yesterday really really clicked with me. Shit. That's when I was like, all right, we're in this together. Let's, Let's go. Let's do this thing. I was waiting for that, too. That one, one little instance, anything happened. I was like, yeah. all right. Let's go. Let's go. Tyler. Let's go. We got to get one before spring's over. Dude, I'm, I'm sad it's taking so long. I, I forgot how fun it is. I know. It's just like, honestly, it's just like a break, like a little refresh. It's refreshing for everyone. Yeah. It is. It is. It's like, uh, it's cathartic. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, dude. What was that? Um, I was so confused. I was just going to go with it. I didn't want to say anything. I'll, I'll explain later. All right. <laughs> so this will be your first big, big crowd in the DWR. Yeah, dude. I'm excited. How many I'm excited. Come out? Hopefully, hopefully a lot. I hope so. I'm too. hoping so. Dude, I heard people are tailgating. Like what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's crazy. How many were there That's last what we year? Do. Last year there was pretty. There was a good amount last year. There was year. a good amount last year. Yeah, but this year, I mean, especially with Coach Petrino's offense. That's what I'm thinking. I think it's going to be. And bro, just Coach Petrino being back. Yeah, and it's like an actual game. Like that's what they're like yeah, promoting dude. it as. We didn't do that yeah. last year. No, last year was what we did two Saturdays ago. Is what we did last year. <laughs> it was like the stands were really crowded, and they were just watching us do like situational NBA. periods. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, I don't know. They were a second and third play. It. <laughs> we're gonna be on like different teams. It's gonna be sick. I think. I think we'll, it's, I think it's one o two d two versus two o one d. Yeah. yeah. I don't so know we'll that. we'll still be together. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But you thought okay. we were gonna be on different. No, teams. no, no, no. I knew we were gonna be together, but like, <laughs> that'll be cool though. I did, and then uh, the winner gets a big breakfast from Busy's. Are you serious? Yeah. I thought it was. Ah, uh, never mind. Because Coach Saturdays, you remember he cooked. First last year, or was that Maybe? after fall camp? He uh, he uh, they went upstairs and like him and the strength staff. Oh, uh, I don't know what that was for. I think that was just. I think that was just, just them being guys. dudes. Just guys being guys. Yeah, yeah. Wait, are you serious about the breakfast though? 
Yeah, the winner gets Busy's breakfast and the loser gets cereal. Which I'm like, I haven't cereal? really had cereal since I've gotten to college. So like, what do you mean? Like, they just give you a box of cereal? Yeah. Is that after the I game mean, or? No, nah, I think or, it's Monday after the uh, okay. our team meeting. That suck for you, like, trying to gain weight. <laughs> Getting, like, five bowls of cereal. Damn. Oh, man. I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. Yeah. But no, I'm like a fake, like, bowl trophy or something. <laughs> Spring ball champ. <laughs> <clears throat> Man, it's gonna be it's gonna be hype. Is That'd that the uh, hype? Yeah, it'll be hype. So be lit. <laughs> <laughs> Straight fire. Straight fire. That's it. No, it is exciting. Do you know what team we're gonna be on? Are we gonna be on the white team or the red team? Are we gonna be wearing jerseys? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, we were, last year we were white, weren't we? We were white. I kind of rocked that all white with the red helmet. And the QBs <sighs> weren't the QBs in Anthracite <laughs> black. No, the dark gray. Yeah, this year. Did you see the? It's yeah, this year black. they're like black, but it's just black. I, I wish. Like I wish like, it was anthracite. I, got I love the anth- anthracite jerseys. It's Have a, you, you? You know the dark gray. The I wish red. I wore those. Those were awesome. You wore them? No, I wish we did. Uh, I wish we did too. But we did. We cooked up a lot, like a lot of good combos last year. I like that white helmet, dude. Our our yeah, combo to Florida. Clean. At the, the Florida jersey. game was really good. Dude, the white on white on white. I like the man. What was it? A and M. Look at us reminiscing on pictures. <laughs> These ones. <laughs> oh, they wore that last year. They wore the QBs wore these for the spring game. Those are pretty sick. You uh, have you ever seen the? Like, I think. <laughs> don't quote me on that. <laughs> Somebody got a picture of that. This was the Florida game last year. <laughs> Getting walked off the field. Man. The, um, uh, we do like a, or I guess last, not last year, a while ago, the Cowboys jerseys that we did. Like our jerseys. Is that what those are supposed to be? Yeah. Like you see them in the front. Yeah. I wish we did those. Those are cool. I like the weird jerseys. I do too. And people are like, oh, weird jerseys. But like, yeah. dude, who doesn't like weird jerseys? Like, that's <laughs> so sick. It's just like so college football. Yeah. Like, you're not I mean, seeing that in the NFL except nah. Color Rush. Even that's kind of. Uh, like some of them, like the Seattle's bright neon green. Those, the Broncos, all orange. Yeah. That's tough. Ja- the Jags had a gold one one year. That was pretty yeah. cool. Yeah. Whenever I, I play know, Madden, I that's my go-to. Mm, mm. You'd always choose the crazy jerseys. Yeah, so I have to. You have to. You're not just going to rock <laughs> classic. Classic Who's way doing? home. No. Dude, if, if you're playing Madden with the classic jerseys, you're just... You're a menace. You're, not really you're a menace. Bad. <laughs> you're about you're really good or really bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, Bro, I never like even... Like, I don't like to play Madden. Like, me neither. That was never a thing for me. Like, I played okay. 2K... Do you think you'll like to play the new NCAA? Oh, yeah, hands down. I think, yeah. I played the old one a lot. Yeah. But, but like, if it feels like Madden, are you going to play it? I, dude, I don't I play Madden in so long. I think it would just like, be cool to play. Like, I'm going to obviously play yeah. it, but I'm saying, yeah. like, grind I it. I don't know. I'm not, in, I'm not invested in an NFL team. So when I play Madden, like, it's not the same. Yeah. I hear what you're saying. Like I've just I've been around college football, so it's yeah. more exciting for me. I think college football in general is just more exciting. Like I, yeah. I like, like, I'll put on college football games, but like, I'm not really waiting to put on an NFL game. Well, it's like someone's. I think some NFL player said he doesn't like watching college football because it's not like as good of quality as not like, the NFL. Yeah, but like that's kind of the appeal. Yeah, like they're not. Everything's not perfect. You're gonna get some crazy, yeah, exactly, silly play that's never gonna, never should have happened, but exactly. it, it happened and it's amazing. Yeah, and then there's rising stars too. Like, yeah, you get to see dudes like break out. Like, yeah, mm-hmm. return a ninety yard punt. You know, yeah. like that stuff's cool. I feel like the crowds are more into it. Oh yeah, dude. But what's up with like the NFL like super fans that like show up in like face paint, like shoulder pads? That's wild. The Raiders. Like that dude probably was nine to five. You know, he showed up Saturdays just face dude. paint, shoulder pads. They're about <laughs> it, bro. They're about it. Dude, what I if know. he What if he works like an office job? Just <laughs> he just shows up there. He's like, "What's up, guys?" <laughs> yeah, the Raiders, man. Speaking about fans, do you think we'll have like the little like walk? No. Into- 
We didn't last year, did we? No. No, no. we just we just jogged in. We jogged good. from the. Maybe it'll be different because it's a game, but I don't maybe know. I don't know. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, honestly, I hope not. Yeah. The walk is it just it's a big deal. Like to you have to load the buses and then yeah. drive the buses over, and then uh, I'd rather just get up and go. Yeah. Because right. then you have to get dressed in the stadium. And right. You got to transfer. Then you got to undress in the stadium, and now it's just. Oh, so we're gonna get dressed in the. Uh, we're not gonna get dressed in the stadium. I don't we'll think so. We'll probably just do the same thing, like meetings and everything, and then just. That's what we did last year, right? Yeah. It's so long ago, I can't remember. <laughs> Dude, yeah, it's, it's weird. Like a year ago or something. <laughs> Football <laughs> makes years feel so weird. Like, it just, I don't know. Especially that, like, in-season, dude, that feels so long. Once we get to, like, the spring, I'm like, dude, the year's, like, almost over. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> September and October are, like, four times longer than January and February. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty wild. January, they went like that. Dude, they did. He was, Coach Patez was like, we installed that in January. And I was like, we did install that in January. <laughs> yeah, that did feel weird when he said that. I was like, dude, I don't know. I feel like that was just like, I don't know, so long ago. Yeah. You just like put it in perspective. And you're like, that was what, two months ago? Yeah. Three months ago? Three, depending on what part in January, yeah. yeah. Well, another big news story this week. Are y'all into basketball? Oh, yeah. Sometimes. Well, you're about to be, man. I know. I'm excited. We're about I'm to excited. be hard. New Razorback basketball coach, the guy from Kentucky. <laughs> John, Calipari. John Calipari. John Calipari. I didn't know his first name, and yeah. I thought it was Calipari. It's Calipari. To each your own. Yeah. I don't know how he pronounces it. Dude, so you know they called, uh, they did the must bus. I saw some. You saw the Twitter thread where they're trying to come up one with uh, I Calipari. Saw one, it was like the Calzone. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, the one so was cool. the Break Caliper. <laughs> uh, if it's Calipari, they should have like a like a pear costume. <laughs> That'd be so be goofy. <laughs> just like that's his old thing. Yeah, he's just on the he's on the uh, the sidelines, just eating a pear. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, no, that's pretty cool though. I never. I've never been to a basketball game here. <clears throat> what? Really? Yeah. Have you? I went to one, and I actually went to Kentucky. Oh. And oh, yeah, wait. I saw you there. Yeah, we heard right. that together. <laughs> <laughs> we, <laughs> oops. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, so I guess I've been to two. I've been to one and a half. I didn't. I left halfway through the Kentucky game. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not into, like, the whole, like, standing up the whole time and stuff. Like, I'd rather just sit oh, yeah, down and watch them. Like, and gosh. especially because in basketball arenas, the chairs are comfy. Yeah. So, like, it's if everyone like, sits, we can all see. But being in the student section would be kind of sick. For a big game. Yeah. Yeah. In which I feel like we're going to have a lot next year. Like, I love going to baseball games. Baseball That's games are fun. sick. Like, those, I don't know about yeah, baseball. Yeah, those games are sick. So, like, I wouldn't want to watch baseball, like, on my TV. Yeah, yeah. That's fair. Like, I will. I'd rather be at the game. Yeah. Yeah, no way I'm watching it on TV. Well, because when you're at the game, you can do other things in between, like during the long stretches where nothing yeah. happens. At home, you're just like scrolling on TikTok. Yeah. You're waiting for the game to get back <laughs> on. Well, like a lot of the games you can't even watch at home. No. But I've tried I to watch... tried to watch the one yesterday, and ESPN was like, this isn't available for your broadcast service. I was like, what? Yeah, I see that all the time, and I don't even know what that means. Well, I, uh, my, my old roommate gave me some website that like has all those sports streaming. Oh yeah. Stream East. No, it's like, uh, it's Mark key streams or something. Send me that. It's got like five K's and six Y's. It's weird, but it has like MMA and see like all the college sports, NFL, Stream East. I love Stream East. Stream East is clutch. But it still never like has any of the baseball games. I, yeah, watch. I don't know. I guess people like aren't that in demand for college baseball games. I feel like there's just so many of them. Yeah, there's so, just way too many games. Like I watched Texas a and play UTSA last night. It was a, kind of a good game, too. Not really? Gonna, yeah. I Who actually won? went to the a hmm. yeah, walk-off that's, home run. Oh, really? Oh, wow. Yeah. That's a good game. Yeah. UTSA Man, so I should have watched like the last five minutes of it. Yeah. But like, it was cool. Like, <laughs> right. 
A and M was coming back. I was like, oh man, because they were number three, and UTSA is like unranked. Oh really? A and M's oh because they haven't <laughs> they haven't really played anybody yet, right? But they're under. They've only lost like one game. They haven't played the Hogs yet. They haven't, haven't played the Hogs. No, they haven't played. I don't think so. I love watching our baseball games. It's so, so much cool fun. Oh Dude, yeah, Dude, I'll, so awesome. I'll track it on my phone. And Susie's like, "What? Why are you looking at baseball scores?" I'm like, "Cause we're number we're one. I want to make sure we're still number one." That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, is it kind of hot in here? I'm, I'm pretty cozy. That's are you a building up to something? Play. No. Oh, no. I thought you were gonna take your jacket off <laughs> and it's gonna be like some cool shirt. Week. Yeah. Is that what you build up? Yeah. <sighs> oh, dude, I should just scratch out Scholar of the Week and put podcast. Oh, that'd be pretty cool. Dude, I hope we get like ETH shirts or something. Oh, and br- oh, like I thought you meant, I thought you were really into like crypto. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope we get some like crypto shirts. Now, wouldn't that be cool though? Because you yeah. see like all these other teams and they're like, they got like shirts for their mottos and everything yeah. and like whatnot. Done right, it's pretty good. I think that'd be really cool. You gotta, it, it, it walks a fine sauce. line between tacky and cool. But I feel right. like for like us, like. Oh yeah, it'd be like, cool. If we do it right. Yeah. I think we can do it right. It's pretty cool. I believe in sauce. Sauce can make it right. Oh yeah. Yeah. Does sauce make the decisions on those Dalton. or? Dalton. Dalton. Okay. Yeah. I believe in them. I do too. We should, oh, we've we got a good EQ staff. To, oh yeah. We just got to be the ones to bring it up to them. Yeah, apparently you just got to ask for things. That's what I'm going to start doing. I'm just going to start asking stuff. Do yeah, we especially have... like our status now. Like we've been here for a couple of years. Yeah. Like, All right, cool. I'll give you another pair of shorts if you need them. It's like, oh, thanks, guys. It's nice. Oh, yeah, I stole your shorts, by the way. I'll bring them back. <laughs> Today? Nah, Tuesday. <laughs> Which ones? I don't know. I found them in your locker. So it, it, it's tragic. I was rushing out of the house to go to practice, and I put sweatpants on because it looked like it was going to be rainy, which means uh-huh. it was going to be windy. And I thought I'd be cold when they took me to class uh-huh. in the golf cart. And mm-hmm. I was like, okay. but So I wore sweatpants. And then I, we were late coming out of practice, and I was rushing. And I didn't have time to cool down. Mm-hmm. And I knew if I put sweatpants on, I would Sweat. just dr- be drenched. Yeah. And so I needed some shorts, and the only shorts anybody, no one had any shorts. Yeah. So I just looked in your locker, found one, and that's respect. Yeah, I would lend you a pair of shorts. I figured you would. I didn't think you'd mind. No, so I'll bring them back at no, some I point. Appreciate that. Of course. Were they like the just all red ones? Yeah. I'm just asking for another pair. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. Because <laughs> Luke was gonna give me like his personal shorts. I was like, no, I just want <laughs> Arkansas shorts. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not getting something you paid for. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, just bring them back. I'll just. Walk around in a towel until it's then. Like wash or something. <laughs> How was he going to get around? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> that's crazy. Hey, that's for the team. That that's is, embracing the that hog is. right there. That's a we guy, that's not a me guy. He wanted to make sure that you got to class. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Just imagine he's just at the facility all day. He's like, dude, <laughs> when is Bron getting back Jeez. with my shorts? <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. That'd be hilarious. Mm. Luke's a good guy. Luke is a good guy. We have so many Lukes on our team, too. Dude, there's a lot of Luke's around the facility. <laughs> like our uh, the uh, equipment guy with us, Luke. Mm, yeah, I like him. I like him too. Man of few words, but many actions. Yeah. Which one is Luke? He's the uh, he's always doing the cadence for the Sunday. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I see him at the baseball game yesterday. Really? Yeah, dapped him up. He's a cool guy. Had like a cooler him. with him. Nice. There we go. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, this dude's sick. All right. Yeah. All right, Luke. We should all go to a baseball game. Dude, yeah, that'd be sick. Can we sit in like the regular seating, though? They're actually playing right now. I don't know what uh, San Jose State. We got the score on that. Oh, are you going to the game? I went You were going to go. I went to the the game yesterday, yesterday, yeah. Did it rain on y'all? Uh, very little, dude. It was like because I was at Nukes. It was beautiful. Started pouring down. (laughs) Really? I was like, dang. You were such a Nukes fan, Dude. dude. Oh, right. I love Nukes. Nukes, McAllister's. Wow. Nukeskies. McAllister's is good. I think Nukes is overrated. 2-0. 2-0. Let's go. State. Not cutting it. Beating the hogs. You got, any, <laughs> you got any buddies on the uh, baseball team? Yeah, I said what's up. I actually met one of their dads yesterday at the game. There was actually a pretty good turning out for San Jose State. Surprised. That was the number one team, yeah, dude. dude. Yeah, that is You're true. You're number one. If, at the coolest ballpark. Dude, we do have dude. an awesome Awesome ball. Sick. 
It's, it's why it's why I chose where to live. I was like, live right next to the baseball stadium. It's freaking beautiful. It's it's really nice. When it uh when it snowed, uh, we yeah. walked over to the baseball field, and I was trying to like sneak in see if I could. We kind of chickened out. It was unlocked. Y'all need to start locking these things. It was unlocked. Whenever it snowed, I walk around. The baseball stadium was unlocked. The practice field was unlocked. Oh yeah, like. You also got a key fob for the practice fields. Oh, yeah. I mean, I could have I got in if I wanted to. But, like, the doors were wide open. First, sometimes I leave the stadium. Like, it's doors open. Yeah. I'm like, I, went to, uh, I don't need to go in here, but I could. Cool. I could right now. I yeah. went to give my brother and his family a tour of the facilities. And Coach Souders gave me his keys to go show him the field. It was wide open. <laughs> and I was like, okay. Which, I mean, like, some places do. Like, at Florida, the stadium was always open. So people could run the... Like, they would run the stadium, and they would uh, hang out in there. But, like, here it's always locked. You know, I think it's cool that people don't, like, mess with the grass. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't know. I feel like at other places that just wouldn't happen. And that happened at San Jose State? No, but I, like, it was always locked. But we also had turf, too. But I feel like if we did oh, have grass, turf. like, I feel like oh. people would just kind of, like, golly. Yeah, dude, turf, it was not fun. We That's practiced like a, on there, too. Oh. Dude, all the time on turf. Did yeah. you practice in the stadium every practice? Well, we had like, we'd usually have like two weeks on the grass, and after those two weeks, the grass would be completely torn up, that it was just like mm. dirt. So, like, we were like, it was like a hazard to be out there. So, yeah. it'd be like, all right, well, we'll go back there at the end of the season once like the grass gets better, and the grass just never gets better. Oh. And so, then we're in the stadium the entire time. Yeah. Dude, the worst is when you get like to the halfway point in the season and you're about to get to your bye week. And so they try to like, uh, is it resod or when? When do they? Uh, they put like sand in there. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. They make the field all sandy, it's and like then you have to we... do the second half of the season in a dirty, sandy field every day of the week. And like you're immediately sandy because when we go for stretching, like we're yeah. getting down on the ground. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. oh my bro. And if it rains the day before, so uh. it's like wet sand. That indoor is nice, though, that we have. Yeah, I yeah, love indoor's it. Indoor is nice. Dude, but that turf, that turf gets hot. During camp, the turf would get really? hot. Out the outside yeah. turf? Oh, I can imagine. Bro. Yeah. I can imagine. You remember playing on um, uh, War Memorial's turf? Oh, my goodness, yeah. Dude, I'm still finding little pellets everywhere. That was the, like, scratchiest, roughest Ooh. turf ever. What stadium? In we open, We opened the season at War Memorial in Little Rock. Oh. And it's it's a great environment. It's like I loved playing cool. there. It was yeah. it was cool. The you stay like in downtown Little Rock. Mm-hmm. I'd never been to Little Rock, so I, I thought it was cool. Either. But the turf is kind of rough. It's pretty rough. Love it. Gritty. Great atmosphere though. Gritty. Yeah. Like, it's was, fun. Yeah. yeah. I wish we played there like maybe like halfway through the year. Yeah. Because it's refreshing to be in a not a college right. stadium. Hundred percent. They used to play like their really big games there. Yeah. Like play, they used like, to Texas play LSU there. there. Yeah, LSU. Really? Like, Alabama, yeah. And it only seats like forty thousand. But I guess that was a lot back then, you know? I mean that's fair, yeah. Was it probably the bigger stadium back? It was more accessible, like before they had T V like streaming uh, and that's stuff. That's why they do it. They do it in Little Rock's community. So that all the fa- like fans Big that fan base can't there. go to Fayetteville can go to Little One in Little Rock. Yeah. Because wow. pretty, I guess. You know, I mean, three hours is far to come for a football game. Yeah. Unless you're like dedicated. You but think people do that? But what a lot of people do at football games doesn't really mesh with a three hour drive afterwards. Yeah. So. No. <laughs> definitely <laughs> not. Yeah. Go Hogs. And one time uh, on a recruiting visit, we went, we woke up and my dad drove us to Alabama, which was like five hours, six hours. Yeah. And then we went and we went to the game and then we drove home. <laughs> and it was awful. No, I mean, it was it, fun. It was a I good did, experience, but it was just a long I drive. I did that too for Alabama. <laughs> we drove there, watched the game. It was like a 12 o'clock game. Drove back. I was like, oh my gosh. I mean... It's Alabama, so you're going to see it, but yeah, it's a long drive. Yeah, yeah. What's what's the? See, but you're from out west, so like, the only big schools was USC, but they were never really. They weren't good. Yeah, too. not when you were. I mean, that's right. Yeah. I didn't think about that. Yeah. Yeah, y'all got so, one. USC. I, I mean, UCLA. Utah. Utah was. It's always true, really yeah. tough. Uh, Trying to think, Utes. 
Oregon, but like that's that's the halt. Yeah. Because when you get out west, the states are huge. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Dude. It still blows my mind when I look at a map and I see like the East Coast and then the West Coast is like twelve states <laughs> yeah. that just span uh they're massive. California is massive, like Yeah. It goes California, it goes California, Oregon, Washington, right? Yeah. And those are as that takes up as much area as Georgia all the way to freaking New York, basically. It's pretty wild. That is crazy to think about. What did you think of uh you were on Mountain Time, right? Yeah. Oh, what did you think man. of that time Dude, zone? Is it wait so is Mountain Time like one less than us. That's right. Yeah, no, 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 no. Eastern, Central, I, Mountain, Pacific. I don't think, was that a mountain time? Oh. Dude, I honestly couldn't tell. Were you on it. Pacific time? I think so. What okay. time would it be right It'd now? It'd be, we're two hours behind. Okay, so you're on Pacific. Yeah. How'd you like that? Dude, it was, it's nice because you watch games and like, games mm. end at like 11. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. At the latest. Here, like games are ending and it must be cool to start at like 10 a.m. Right. Or 9 a.m. even. Yeah. Because you can wake up, like roll out of bed, and boom, college football. College football all is day. on. That's pretty cool. But I will say it would be like hard sometimes to wake up for college game day. I loved college game day. Mm, I would yeah. sleep past it, and I would be like, damn. Because then I'd see like Lee Corso like putting on the hat or like the mascot. And I'm like, oh, all right, well, the games are on now. Yeah. I see, love game day. College football is such an institution, man. It's just they did it right. Yeah, they did it right. They did do it right. Like who thought of like college game day? Whoever thought of that is Props to them. genius. And then who's like Lee? You have to put on a mascot head yeah. at the end of every show. Yeah, like that's just I don't know, dude. Let's let's get college game day here, dude. dude. That'd, be so, that'd be awesome. Dude, we play Texas later in the year. I know we're gonna make it happen. We're gonna make it happen. We're gonna make that hey, shit happen. You're not superstitious. I haven't. Though. I didn't say anything. Oh yeah, you were weird about that. Yeah, I'm. I'm so superstitious that I don't even acknowledge superstition. Yeah. That's crazy. You're yeah. so beyond it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I've transcended superstitions. Uh, but no, it's like uh, my brother would always say: "There's no such thing as a jinx." Just to, like, Make sure spite that he... the superstition. He's like, because if you, if you go so hard the other way, it balances out the scales. That's fair. Okay. I kind of yeah. like that. I'll knock on wood, though. Just knock on wood if you're with me. There we go. There we go. Let's go. Uh, well, yeah, so we got spring game coming up this Saturday. Mm-hmm. And then, before you know it, it'll be the season. Dude, it's going to happen fast. Just wait. It's literally going to be August in no time. Oh, man. And then oh, we got camp. Let me see. Who do we open with? Pine Bluff. Pine Bluff? We open with Pine Bluff? Pine Bluff. Oh, that'll be, that'll be fun because it'll be in Little Rock. Yeah. And it'll be do a we bunch play? of Arkansas people. Oh, yeah. Do we play um, Oklahoma State second? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's play cool. Oklahoma State at Oklahoma State. I'm excited for that one. Yeah. Let's pull up the schedule here. Because Auburn's our fourth, but it's our first SEC, right? Yeah, it goes Oklahoma State, UAB, Auburn. Yeah, UAB. I'm excited to go. What do they call it? The Plains? Auburn. UAB? Auburn? No, oh, Auburn. Yeah. Sorry. Auburn's it's pretty, pretty cool there. I see them swag surf. Dude. Go play at Auburn. I mm -mm. did. I have. You you played Auburn? Yeah. yeah. Auburn's Whoa. cool. Dude. Yeah, that was my second a, start ever. They got terrible away locker rooms, though. Oh, they're horrible. Really? They're You've been there? Yeah, we played them. Oh, uh, that's right. Freshman year. Yeah. It's pretty cool, though. I will say that. The fourth like, quarter, the swag surf is pretty Were y'all out there on the field for the eagle flying around? I think mm, so. I wasn't, sadly. Dang. That, that was pretty cool. I don't want to see we, that. Could, but like, it's sick because you're like in the locker. You hear them because it's like the locker's yeah. down here. And like the stadium, like is like oh. right above. It's kind of like Ole Miss a little bit. Okay. Yeah. And so, yeah, you walk out, and then you hear like 
the eagle, or you don't hear the eagle, but you hear like the people going crazy. <laughs> I hate that we missed the flyovers. Like that is so cool. There's flyovers yeah. for our games. Bro. What? Oh yeah. oh yeah. Like that's the coolest thing ever. But we just don't. We won't ever get to see those. Is it like helicopters yeah. or like? Zoom, it or depends. Like they choose different ones. Some have, have, did we? Uh, we did the parachute dudes one time, didn't we? For like probably military appreciation week, I think. Maybe. It's pretty cool. I don't know. I'm pretty oblivious to. uh, I forget. I just look at it after. I'm like, Uh, nice. (laughs) Sweet. (laughs) Yeah. I'm just like so (laughs) focused on getting to the game. Yeah. Because like I'm always worried I'm going to get out there and be like, oh no, I forgot my knee braces. Yeah. Yeah. Like the the silly things that, of course, you're not going to forget. I have to check my travel bag like 10 times before I can turn it in. Yeah, the travel bag is a scary one because that could ruin a routine. (laughs) Dude, we got to one game. And the senior, the starting fifth-year senior tackle left his knee braces. <laughs> and the coach was like, dude, how do you, lo- like, do you, how do you leave your knee braces? What do you do in that situation? You're like, uh. He had to use someone else's. That would suck. That would be awful. I couldn't. Mm. I would just. Ooh. And then we got, that's a good SEC opening schedule. We go Auburn, A&M in Dallas, and then Tennessee. How was that Dallas game, man? It's fun. It's cool to play in the Cowboy cool. Stadium. I can imagine. I think it's really cool. It'll be a lot cooler when we win. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was watching that game, actually. I saw the highlights, like, I think, like, two nights ago, dude, and we're better. Like, like our group. Like, yeah. Dude, yeah. It just, I don't know. Dude, that, game, that game was weird. Like, the... Weird. That game, like, it felt... We were like, all right, here we go. We're about to... We're about to come back and we're about to run this thing. And we come out at halftime, we get like a pick six like immediately. It's an accident. And we're yeah. like, here we go. It's like, this is it. And then, nope. Bro, that's the thing. Like, there was no energy at halftime. It dude, didn't look like it on the field. Ball. That's like, dude, because the sidelines, dude, like, people don't understand, but that plays so much. Oh, like, yeah. So it's, much into the it's game. It's huge. A we healthy just, sideline is huge. We got we to gotta make an emphasis on that this year. Yeah. Bro, because you see Ole Miss doing that. Like, they got dudes, towels waving, yeah. Lane Kiffin oh, sun spraying no, the that's, fire extinguisher. <laughs> that's them Juice Boys, dog. <laughs> juice Boys? That's that Nick Savage special. <laughs> Nick Savage? Yeah, they're, like they're uh, strength, strength coach. Bro, we need to get they, Tommy uh, on that. When he was at Florida, they would call them Juice Boys. And they'd have a Juice Boy of the Week, and they get a T-shirt and everything. So, like, if you weren't one or two deep, you were... With can't them, a juice boy. you were with them, and you had a towel, and you were juicing See, everyone dude, up. We need to do that. Can we? Can we introduce that to Sam? Yeah, let's do it. He probably knows. Yeah. We can do dude. whatever we want. We run yeah, this. Thing. <laughs> I mean, it's got to be a player-led team, bro. Hey, as a leader, dude, for real. As a freshman, yeah, juice boys. I, was, I felt juice like boys. I was one of the juiciest guys on the sideline. Really, you gotta be. Yeah, but, freshman year was cool because, like, that's when like we were like freshman year is the, the most enjoyable year. Oh yeah. So, like, me, Brooks, and Brock are all standing on the sidelines. We're like, oh. <laughs> You're just Brock going crazy. Yeah, you, it was you. great. It was great. Then I get out there on punt, do my thing, <laughs> jog back in. <laughs> and when you're a freshman, you're like, the games mean a lot. But in yeah. the back of your head, you're like, oh, I still got four more. So, like, and it's then not like, the end of the world. I don't know about you guys, but I knew I was never going in. As a freshman, I was just kind of oh. like I was on the trip. Dude. I was well. You were on punt. <laughs> yeah. I like in my That's, mind, I expected you. I was like, dude, why aren't playing me? And then like I look back, I'm like, thank God I did not get the games. Yeah. Oh my god, no, I was, dude. I there was one game where I thought there was no chance I was getting in. <laughs> it was my freshman year. We're playing Georgia in the Jag Stadium, oh, oh, and the le- the week leading up, I'm like, you know what? I'm a freshman playing Georgia. Most likely not going to get in. I'm just going to enjoy it. So like I was, I wasn't not paying attention in meetings, but I was like, as a freshman though, yeah, yeah. I, know I was like, all right. Just, I mean, yeah, this is important, but I'm not going to play. Halfway through the second quarter, right guard goes down, and I'm standing like by myself, just like looking around the stadium, like, oh, this is pretty cool. <laughs> I mean, the Jags play here. Like, this is sweet. First <laughs> NFL stadium, okay. And I just hear my name getting screamed. And I look over at my coach, and he grabs me. He's like, you're in the game. He throws me in there. I go out there. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, my God. The center, they call one play, and I look to the center. I was like, what do I do? He's like, just block that guy. I was like, all right, thanks, Heggy. And then I played the rest of the game. Oh, That's my wild. God. It was insane. Did y'all win? 
Yeah. Dude. Wow. Oh, I would have been on top of the mountain. Oh, it was great. It was a great feeling. That is pretty sick. My that freshman was... year was pretty solid. That was fun. Did you play other games after that? Uh, so I played... I think it went... I played against Missouri the week before. I got in for like the first... My first like offensive snaps was against Missouri. The timeline may be messed up on here. And then played Georgia. And then I think it was Arkansas next. And I played a decent bit. And then the next, the following week, I started against Vandy. And then, I, then the, the true two guard, like the third guard, was hurt. He tore his ACL and during camp. And so that's why I was playing. He came back like the week of Vandy. So they gave me the start, but he played more. So like I started, did like I played like the first half, and then he took the rest, and I didn't play on the offense again. Damn. I mean, that's, that's just the way cool it is. You play though, yeah. as a freshman. Like, I wasn't that's, complaining. Dude, yeah, that's, be on top of the world. I was on field goal, so it burned my red shirt, which was during COVID. Let's which go. was well, it was good though, <laughs> because during COVID, if you oh, if yeah, you didn't really appear mean. in more than four games during COVID, you don't get a COVID year. Really? I didn't know that. They use that as your red shirt year. I didn't. That's know. what I've heard. I think it varies college to college. So so you kind of lucked out. Oh, yeah. Wow. I would have been straight, though. But yeah. That's right. For real. That's what, that's what I played on offense in four games, but I was started on field goal in 11. For, that's or, sick. Holding it down on special 10. teams. Bro. No. So you, were, you yeah. had to be locked in every game. I was more locked in than not. Yeah. I mean, I was, like, locked in, but I was, like, clipboard guy. Mm. I was – I held it down on the clipboard. Got all yeah. the plays. Got my ass chewed. Oh. Can't say that. I got I got chewed out a few times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, it builds character. Though. It does, dude. But let me tell you, I wrote down those plays, the blitzes. I was on That's it. Respect. And then on defense, walls well, rowdy. Tau. Yeah, yeah. Defense Ooh. is like <laughs> freshman because you're not dog tired sitting on the bench trying to look at plays and recover. You're just watching the game you're like, yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> awesome. Now it's yeah. you're just <sighs> Water. Uh, yeah, there's no. And the, the worst part is when you've been standing there for three and a half quarters oh, and they sorry. throw you in like oh. in garbage time and your knees are locked up, your back is tight, and you're like, oh man. <laughs> Never got garbage time. Really? Mm -mm. They Oof. put Auburn game, we were like blowing them out. And uh, I was playing, I was the second straight center and they put Bo at center to get Bo reps. Mm. And I was like, ah. Oh. Crushed me. <laughs> <laughs> Crushed me. Uh, I only well, got garbage time one You got time. some center reps last year. There you go. Yeah. Did you actually? Yeah, yeah you started, started a center for a game. Dude, Miss. what? Bro, I played center, left guard, and right tackle uh, <laughs> versus Ole Miss. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Wow. Yeah. It was fun. Yo, that was a fun game. <laughs> that was a pretty fun game. <laughs> Bro, how did we score on that one drive? There was a one play where like a couple of us just touched nobody. <laughs> like we dumped it to tires. Dude, there was there was one play. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, what? Sorry, this computer. Oh, I thought you were about to be like, dude, we were not recording. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, like, dude, that happened to me. I missed uh there was one week where I only released one and it was because the audio didn't record and I didn't feel like redoing it, so I just <laughs> skipped it one. But there was one play during the Ole Miss game where I, I went to pull, and the field was so like soggy that I just oh. slipped and face planted, <laughs> and the, the the running back passed me, and I just got up and just like, like just blocked him like forward as far as he could Man, go. That's so funny. Uh, you remember um, <laughs> Alabama when I um, galloped down? <laughs> <and st <laughs> We were, we were, yeah, we were in a pass run. play. Oh, what? Because they sounded similar. It was, it was iron the, it was, and fire. Yeah, it was iron and fire. He heard iron, which is <laughs> like, power. Yeah. Okay. And so fire like is, ba what was, what was fire? It was like it was rip. Like, yeah. Rip. It was like full slide right. Oh, and so I slide right, and he just takes I'm off, like, clocks my guy, and just takes <laughs> off for the linebacker. We get to the sideline. I was like, what are you doing? He tells me what happens. He's so nervous. He's like, what do I tell coach? So he's like, you know what? I'm just going to lie. What did you what did you come up with? I don't even remember. No, was I like, I just heard iron. 
<laughs> I just heard iron. He called it iron, coach. Dude, but yeah, we got like a fifty-yard run on that. Play. Oh, shit, no, it was like the biggest. It was gain beautiful. Of the, the biggest gain of the game, dude. KJ took it down <laughs> right down the sideline, got us to like the thirty. So we got you, a field goal off that or something. No, I think it it got us back into the game. Yeah. So you created that play. Yeah. I threw the defense off so bad. Dude, dude, the, the DM rush was like. Oh yeah, you can said, see it on film. He rushes doing? up field, stops, thinks it's a screen, and like backs up. And then KJ just like takes <laughs> off. I'm like. There we go. That's that's how it was supposed to work out. See, that's why I love college football. Exactly. That, that wouldn't happen in the NFL. No. They would just do their assignment yeah. like a couple of lamos. Yeah. They'd perfectly pass it. Like, come on. They just lock them Probably up on be the like edge. an incompletion or something. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> KJ scrambles. Fit the yard run. Uh, well, hopefully we'll make many, many more great memories this season. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Man, I'm Amen. excited. I hope y'all are excited as well. Uh, mm-hmm. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you at the spring game this yep. Saturday at noon. Go, Go Hogs. Go Hogs. Go Hogs.